Hello grade 6 learner. Today I want to show you how to do division of a four digit number by a two digit number. Welcome. I've written an example here 4320 divided by 80. It's a simple question. I will show you two methods and the first method is where you use multiplication. So this is our divisor, this is our dividend. So the first question we ask ourselves is, how many times can 80 go into the first digit 4? And since 4 is smaller than 80, we just put a 0 to show that 80 cannot go into 4 because 4 is smaller than 80. We combine now 4 and 3, we form a 43. We ask ourselves the same question. How many times does 80 go into 43? Mailana, I know you are saying it can't again because 43 is smaller than 80. So you put another zero here. So now you combine the three digits and ask yourself, how many times does 80 go into 432? Then you put a comma there, it can go to 432. So I've said the first method is where you take this device and then you check the number you will multiply by 80 to get the nearest to this number 432. And for a quick one, you just take this digit here, the first digit, 8, the tens, and then you look at these first two digits here. We know 8 times 5 gives 40. So the first number we are going to test is 5. Because 8, we know when it's multiplied by 5, it gives 40. So we are going to test 80 times 5. And 80 times 5, 5 times 0, we know it's 0. You are not carrying anything. Then 5 times 8 is 40. We are not going to multiply to test by 6 because we know if we add, we multiply by 6, this number will be bigger than 432. But you can still try. If you try 480 times 6, you get 0, 480. So we can't pick a number which is bigger than this one here, the one we have picked. So we choose 80 times 5. So this 5, we are going to write it here above the 2 here. Then we say 80 times 5 is 400. Mailana, after that, we are supposed to subtract 432 minus this 400. So I get the difference. 2 minus 0 is 2. 3 minus 0 is 3. Then 4 minus 4, you know nothing remains. So that one is over. So now, we have a digit that we have not used, the last digit. Even here, we have a digit that is going to fit here above the zero. So we are still going to continue the division and we are going to drop this zero to join this number here, like that. Then, as I told you, a quick one of knowing which number we need to multiply by 80. Just pick this digit 8, look at these two digits here, just as I told you. We know 8 times 4 gives 32. So that has given us a clue of what we want. So we try 80 times 4. You get 0, 32. And that's the number we wanted. So this 4, we are going to put it here. And then we say 80 times 4 is 320. And then when we subtract, nothing remains. So now our answer, we are not going to say these zeros. Our answer is 54. Remember, just to remind you, this is called the dividend. This is called the divisor. And this is called the ocean. So this answer we have got here, 
This answer we have got here is our quotient. The number that we use to divide is our divisor. And this is the dividend. This is the dividend. So our answer, the quotient is 54. So thank you very much, my learner. And in the next lesson, I'm going to show you how to divide a four-digit number with a two-digit number with a remainder. Remember, this one did not have a remainder. So I'm going to show you how to divide a four-digit number by a two-digit number with a remainder in the next lesson. Bye. And see you in the next lesson.